AD, 150 points tonight. What was it like out there? That's a lot of offense. Yeah, I mean, we allowed him to score 145, so um, played a big fourth quarter from them. Uh, 46, I think. Um, it's terrible defensively. I mean, and they hit some some shots towards the end. Uh, they needed threes, but uh, you know, um, you know, we can do what we want offensively, um, as you can see tonight. But we got to be able to uh, defend, especially when we got a team up like that. Uh, you know, try to give them no life. Uh, but you know, at this point in the season, you know, uh, win is a win. We'll take it. But um, we got to learn from it as well. No D-Lo tonight, but Dinwiddie, 26 points, five assists. What would you see from him tonight? No, just being aggressive. Uh, I said last game he started to, you know, find his finding his way, and um, you know he was aggressive last game. He just carried that over, you know, being himself, hit some threes, uh, attacking the basket, um, being the special that we need him to be. How much do you follow the standings at this date of the season? Um, a little. Uh, no, I mean, it's everywhere right now. But for us, you know, just try to control what we control and just winning, you know, one game at a time. Uh, you know, obviously we try to look and uh, figure out how far we are behind six seed. But um, you, know, you stretch yourself out is and putting too much pressure on yourself when you constantly looking at it. But uh, I think we're ninth right now, so. <laughs> We just got to continue to play our style of basketball and, and focus on us and uh, taking it one game at a time and just worry about winning that game. Um, and if we continuously do that, uh, you know, the rest will take care of itself. This trip coming out, is there a number of wins in your head that would be serious? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, we want to win every game. Uh, I think uh, on this trip, we, we beat everybody. Now that we played Indiana, uh, yeah, we've beaten everybody. Um, so we know we're capable, but um, it's the road, you know. Um, it's going to be tough, but uh, we got the capability of winning each game. Uh, we got to approach it that way. AD, you were able to do a lot of attacking one on one these last couple of games. Just to just wonder the three days off, did you feel any better? Of just kind of getting into a better rhythm with yourself and when you're going to attack your guy? Um. Well, last game, no, they uh, they didn't double um, until late. Uh, well, they doubled early, and I was able to get going late. And then tonight, um, they let me play one on one early. You know, which I try to you know attack men, and uh, then they started doubling a little bit and just kicking it out, and guys started making shots. Um, and then went back to the one on one coverage. So. Um, you no, know, I just try to read the defense. You know, they're doubling me, um, make the right pass out, and you now guys make, been making shots. And then if they if they try to um, go one-on-one -on -one coverage, um, you know, I try to score the basketball. When you came into this season, like depth was supposedly one of you guys' big strengths, and obviously injuries have you know hurt, hurt that. Spencer's just kind of finding his legs underneath him. How can he be? Kind of an important cog over this this final stretch you guys have. Very important. Um, how you play tonight? We're gonna need him to play like that for the rest of the season. Um, instant offense, man. He can score whenever he wants. He's a big guard. He can defend. Um, he play like that. <laughs> Add D'Lo back to the mix. Um, other guys may get healthy. <laughs> We're gonna be a tough team to beat, and we get that depth that everybody, you know, is talking about, um, and that we wanted to have coming into the season. So, um, adding a guy like Spence um, only helps us, but uh, we're, gonna him, we're gonna need him to be the Spence he was tonight. Thanks. Thank you.